If we look to the Quran, we'll find that 3% are commands and prohibitions. 97% of the Quran teaches ethics, the relationship between God and man, the purpose of life, morality, the history of nations in the past, teaches us how to be self-critical, how to use reason and faith, many major themes. You know what I was taught when I became a convert? Rules, rules, rules. If I hadn't studied this religion myself, I would have left it the next day. Let us begin by following the model established by God himself through his prophet Muhammad. Peace be upon him. Do we practice that here? We're trying to win these kids back over to this religion. And the first thing we do is get them in that door. We tell them, okay, okay, you cover your hair. You do this. Don't do this. Don't do that. Don't do that. We are obsessed with only that. Be tolerant. If our kids come to our community not so modestly dressed, it's better that they come than not come at all. If their behavior is not perfect, it's better that they come and hear the message. It's better for them to be among us than not to be among us. If the Prophet and his companions adopted our approach, there'd probably be no Muslims today. How about the time the man came and he urinated in the mosque in that famous Hadith report? The companions were ready to kill the guy. The report says that they already had their hands on him. The Prophet said, let him go. Go get some water and pour it over it. You've been sent to make things easy for people, not to make them hard. Let's follow the Mecca plan. Let's just give it a try.